Welcome. So let's go and get some factoring techniques, all right? Uh, real quick, dividing rational expressions. Uh, we know that when dividing, we're going to have to change our divisor to its reciprocal, and then we can multiply this through. But before we do that, we always want to simplify this problem before we apply our operation. So we see we have a couple trinomials. On these trinomials, we're going to have to be able to factor them. And I'll do this in my head, but I'll talk my way through it. I see that I have a binomial here. And in this binomial, I see I have some common terms so I can factor out the GCF. So we're going to use a couple different factoring techniques uh, to be able to get this done. All right. So the first one, let's just go and simplify this because we know our dividend is not going to change. So x squared minus 6x minus 27. Since my a is 1, I need to determine to factor this. I need to determine what two values multiply to give me negative 27, but then add to give me a negative 6. And I can factor that by x minus 9 times x plus 3. All right, You can do FOIL to check my work. Here I have 2x squared plus 2x. I see what common term can I factor out. Well, I can factor out a 2x. That's going to leave me with an x plus 1. All right. Now I'm going to change this from a division problem to a multiplication problem. But to do that, I need to multiply by the reciprocal of my divisor. So now I'm going to take my x squared on the numerator. And then rather than writing my trinomial on the denominator, I'm going to factor it to its simplified form first. So again, my a is 1. So I need to determine what two values multiply to give me 45, but then add to give me a negative 14. Well, that's going to be x minus 9 times x minus 5. Okay. Now. Again, I have separation with multiplication. But what I showed you last time is we can put these all together if we want to. And then what I see is I have an x squared divided by 2x. Now, I'm just going to do a couple of the, I'm just going to simplify this again just to make sure there's no confusion when dividing, our, um, dividing these. x squared divided by 2x, we know that re goes to 1 half and then x to the 2 minus 1, right? Remember, with exponents, you subtract. So that's going to equal x to the first power over 2. Because since it's positive, it's going to remain in the numerator, and my 2 is in the denominator. All right. Another thing we can just write on this is say, well, that's going to divide. That will divide out, and then we'll be left with 1. So the 2 remains down there. Then we see an x minus 9 divided by an x minus 9, because I could combine these all together and put these 1 over each other. And you would see, oh, it's obviously divided. But we can cross over since everything is being separated by multiplication. So I can just divide them across. Um, and that's OK. And that's going to leave me with an x plus 3 times x in my numerator. I'll write the x in front, divided by a 2 times x minus 5. And since these aren't common terms, or these aren't common terms, we cannot divide it out. That is going to be our simplified answer. Thanks.